In Rivers, a state high court has declared the defection of members of the House of Assembly to the All Progressives Congress null and void. The court sitting in Port Harcourt gave judgment to the suit seeking to declare the lawmaker seats vacant. The claimants, Hyacinth Amadi and three others, approached the court to challenge the eligibility of Martin Amirhile and 26 other lawmakers as members of the House of Assembly. It is just one of the cases that have come before the judiciary relating to the lawmakers' controversial defection from the People's Democratic Party to the All Progressives Congress. The court in its judgment held that the lawmakers are still members of the PDP after the claimants failed to provide proof as required by law of the defendant's membership of the APC. The presiding judge, Justice Okobule Basam, faulted the absence of the APC membership register showing the names of the lawmakers and their membership cards, amongst others. He added that public statements and media publications do not serve as proof of defection. For declaratory relief, it's not about what I admit or what other person has admitted to. It is you about you proving your case. You don't rely on the weakness of the defendant's case. You must by the oppression of law, prove the case on its merit, you must show that, in fact, that the persons you are alleging to have defected has, in fact, defected. It's not about what goes on on the uh, internet, what you watch on TV, what you read up on the pages of newspaper. That is not where defection takes place. If you need to say that somebody has defected and has also become a member of another political party, you must show hard evidence of uh, membership register, of one such person belonging to another political party. The judgment of the state high court comes as a relief to Martin Amirhile, whose position as Speaker of the House was threatened by the emergence of a faction. The court clearly stated that uh, Right Honorable Martin Chike Amirhile remains the Speaker of the State House of Assembly, as well as other members are quiet and remain members of the State House of Assembly, and their laws, the laws that are passed, are legitimate and the state government is bound to obey the laws passed by these honorable members. That's exactly what the court said this morning. The court in its judgment also held that there was no proof that the lawmakers are no longer members of the PDP through resignation, death, expulsion or procurement of another party's membership. Interesting development from River State. 